Wavetool Tutorials, Section 6, Groups and Snapshots. In this video, we will learn what groups and snapshots are, create snapshots and add channels to groups, and lastly, navigate between snapshots. It's helpful to be able to select groups of actors at once, for example, all the lead roles currently on stage. It's also handy to be able to have multiple groups like the lead roles and those in the chorus, not forgetting that an actor might be in both groups. But at other times, you might need different actors in different groups. This is where snapshots come in. A snapshot determines how all the channels in Wavetool are assigned into groups. Saving, then recording different snapshots permits you to change which channels are assigned to which groups. To assign channels to groups and to create snapshots, go to the Edit menu and choose Groups and Snapshots. First choose Edit On and then give the first snapshot a name. Press the plus button and then name the audio groups. Checking a cross point in the matrix assigns channels to the multiple groups. Remember, one snapshot can contain multiple groups. We can add another snapshot by pressing the Add button in the bottom left corner of the window. If you want to duplicate the first snapshot, then tick the Copy Data box, otherwise you can start with another blank snapshot. Once you've named your new snapshot, channel assignments and the group names can be edited. You can customise your group's colours with the colour buttons and you can of course reset them to default if you don't like what you did. Close the window and your new groups and snapshots are created. You can choose which group is selected with the buttons at the top of the window. But to change between snapshots, open the edit menu and choose snapshot list. This list allows you to jump between different snapshots. Snapshot changes can also be programmed to follow MIDI messages in the groups and snapshots window.